hi friends uh, in today's scenario we have a source table like this okay in source we are having ID name and number of item columns and uh, in number of item columns we have numbers like 1 2 3 4 it means we want uh, to develop a mapping in such a way that uh, the first record uh, will be inserted with number of items times means if I am going to insert this uh, record complete so in target table it should be inserted uh, one time for Rajesh it should be two times and for Shoshma it, is sh it should be three times and for Sangeeta it should be four times so our target uh, will be look like this uh, Kamlesh is one time, Rajesh is two times, Shushma is three times, then Sangeeta is four times. So let's do it. So I have already imported my source and targets in this case. So I am developing a mapping. So this will be my name of. Okay, this is the name and uh, in this scenario we are going to use java transformation usually you can do it with the normalization uh, normalizer transformation also so i'm driving my target uh, this is my target one okay closing this one okay now i'm using Java transformation Java. Okay. So, okay create three input ports first is i underscore id second is i underscore name And third is I underscore number of items. So this is integer type. This is integer type. Now the output ports one, two, O underscore um, ID, it is integer type, and then output underscore name this is string type okay that's fine now in the java code um, int i for int i uh, i equals to 0 I'm oh, sorry from 1 i is less than equals to uh, this i number of items then i plus plus and for this uh, output id will be input id semicolon then output name will be uh, input name and then create rows so now compile the code uh, ok Okay, the Java code is um, compilation is successful. Apply it, then connect the output ports. Okay, invalid or what? Oh, sorry, I have not given the connection. Okay, 
can't see it. Generative workflow for this mapping. And my source and target is both in a flat file format, so I'm not giving. Okay, next. Finish. Okay, what we generate in. For this, I am going to delete my target uh, because I have already run this program. So, okay. Now run this. Start workflow on task. It's running. Succeeded. And you can see, so success rules were four, and in target we have. 10 rows ok so let's see the expected output ok the cumlish cumlish was the number of items was only one so it is introduced one time Rajesh two times Shushma three times and for Sangeeta four times ok that's all mm, this was the map hope you like it